This is Alex with Orchid, and I'm going to show you a really cool feature for how to connect uh, to your existing VPN subscription and add a new hop to the Orchid app. So you can see I already have one Orchid hop here that's connecting to a random node. Right now it's not turned on, but if I were to turn it on, it'd be connecting to a random node on the network. Um, and I am going to show you how to set it up with your existing VPN subscription to have a second hop if you want. This is a really cool feature and a really cool way we work with other VPN companies. Um, and first of all, what you're going to want to do is get uh, your username and password handy as well as uh, an open VPN configuration file. How you do that with PIA is you just, I just Googled private internet access open VPN config file and it brought me to this article. I clicked this default file which gave me a zip file and then I open that up in my developer environment and you can see there's a list of locations here that you can select from. I just grabbed the OVPN file from the US West Coast um, and so you can see that, that you could actually pick from many different locations but you just copy and paste that uh, into the app and I'll show you how to do that now. Um, to make things easy I have uh, set it up on my Android phone and already sent myself uh, the codes that I need so uh, in WhatsApp. So you hit new hop um, and then I have a VPN subscription and then you can see I got to enter in my username and password so here's my username paste that grab the password and then grab the OVPN config file Now we're good to go. So I can turn it on and you can see I've got two hops configured. My traffic on my phone is now routing through the ORCID network and then exiting uh, through the node, the, the location that I chose in the OVPN config file for PIA's network. Now I could actually even add another hop using uh, ORCID node to exit on or I could even add a different VPN subscription if I wanted to again and you can kind of do that as many times as you want to create these really cool circuits and further obfuscate your traffic. I uh, hope everybody's having a good day and we're really excited about this feature and we'd love to hear what you think too.